वन मोर प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व आर्क साइन ऑफ फाइव बाई एक्स प्लस आर्क साइन ऑफ ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स इक्वल्स टू फाइव बाई टू सो हि वी नी नॉट गेट एनी कन्फ्यूजन आर्क साइन ऑफ फाइव बाई एक्स इज नथिंग बट साइन इन वर्स ऑफ फाइव बाई एक्स प्लस सिमिलरली आर्क साइन ऑफ ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू दट इज साइन इन वर्स ऑफ ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स नाउ साइन इन वर्स फाइव बाई एक्स प्लस साइन वर्स ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू फाइव बाई टू देन वी नीड टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स सो दैट मीन्स लेट एस प्रोसीड इन दिस मैनर साइन वर्स फाइव बाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू से ये फाइंड साइन ये साइन वर्स ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू बी फाइंड साइन बी देन ए प्लस बी इज इक्वल टू नाइंटी डिग्रीज सो देन ए इज इक्वल टू वी कैन राइट फाइव बाई टू माइनस बी अप्लाई साइन ऑन बोथ साइड्स साइन ए इज इक्वल टू साइन ऑफ नाइंटी डिग्रीज माइनस बी दैट बिकम्स कॉज बी देन इट हैड बेटर टू एक्सप्रेस कॉज बी इन टर्म्स ऑफ साइन बी सो दैट साइन ए एंड साइन बी वैल्यूज कैन बी सब्सटीट्यूटेड सो दैट वी कैन फाइंड आउट एक्स वैल्यू सो लेट एस सॉल्व इट फर्स्ट of all this problem should be restated this problem can be restated as follows like this so given that given that arc sin of 5 by x plus arc साइन ऑफ ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स इक्वल टू फाइव बाई टू सो दिस कैन बी रिस्टेटेड एस साइन इनवर्स फाइव बाई एक्स प्लस साइन इनवर्स ट्वेल्व बाई एक्स इक्वल टू फाइव बाई टू नाउ लेट एस से the sin inverse of 5 by x equal to a now here sin a becomes 5 by x so now let us say the sin inverse 12 by x equals to b now sin b equals to 12 by x that means just if you replace here a b we have a plus b equals to 90 degrees then a equals to pi by 2 minus b because as we know the value of sin a you just apply sin function on both sides so we get sin a equals to sin of pi by 2 minus b so now this can be written sin a is equal to sin 90 degrees minus theta this is the reason sin 90 degrees minus theta equals to cos theta i already told you here sin 90 minus b can be written as cos b again cos b we have to express in terms of sin that we can write root of 1 minus sin square b even you can check cos square b plus sin square b is equal to 1 cos square b is equal to 1 minus sin square b cos b is equal to root of 1 minus sin square b we know the sin a value and sin b value the both the values are to be replaced here so now replacing sin a and sin b values this is 5 by x equals to root of 1 minus sin square b that is 12 by x whole square see this is 5 by x equal to 1 minus 144 by x square correct now better squaring on both sides squaring on both sides so 
so now what does it become 5 by x whole square 5 by x whole square is 25 by x square this is 1 minus 144 by x square so now the actually 144 by x square equal to 1 minus 25 by x square this can be written x square is the LCM x square minus 25 what happens here x square x square gets cancelled so now we get x square minus 25 is equal to 144 so now x square is equal to 144 plus 25 that is 169 so 169 is also a perfect square that is nothing but 13 square so now this can be written x is equal to root of 169 but you get plus or minus so the plus or minus 13 but we whenever these kind of equations are there when we get the solution it is necessary to check whether the given value satisfy the given equation or not so if you just observe this sin was 5 by x plus sin was 12 by x is equal to pi by 2 that will be the positive isn't it now so that's why though we get the minus value negative value the negative value has to be discarded here so we have to consider positive value here so that means here we get the two cases x is equal to 13 and x is equal to minus 13 so now the x is equal to 13 will satisfy this equation but whereas x is equal to minus 13 that you can verify yourself also so better the x is equal to minus 13 is called extraneous solution so that's why here better you take the which the, the value which satisfy the equation so x is equal to 13 and this is not the solution hence you can conclude x is equal to 13 it has been solved see let us solve one more problem solve sin was x plus sin was 2x is equal to pi by 3 so first why should we discuss the problem means first of all so after giving the some instructions or suggestions directly you can do it you need not watch the video so otherwise so you can check the video after completion of your method or you can adopt your the methods different methods because the one method is not specified for the one problem so that means here we have to think for several solutions that means open ended questions that means as many as uh, solutions we have to adopt it so this this might be the one of the method but if you wish you, you can adopt any one of the methods that will be the easier to you so now so let's have a discussion on this one the first let us say the sin was x is equal to a we get sin a is equal to x sin was 2x is equal to b the sin b becomes 2x so that means a plus b is equal to pi by 3 so that means you can opt apply a sine function on both sides or cos function on both sides so that our aim is to determine x value and also possible value that is a possible value means we have to consider either plus value or minus value so that is the method has to be made up uh, that is the method has to be adopted so let us solve this problem now let sin inverse x a sin a equal to x so now sin inverse 2x equals to b sin b equals to 2x so we have a plus b equals to pi by 3 means 60 degrees that is pi by 3 so let us apply cos function why not you can apply sine function also here let us apply cos function apply cosine function on both sides
now we get cos of a plus b equal to cos 60 pi by 3. So, you may have one doubt also. Why should we take cos? The cos pi by 3 is 1 by 2. So, if you consider instead of cos sine, what value do you get? Just expect it. So, you are going to get root 3 by 2. So, that will be somewhat complicated. So, it had better to take cos. The cos 60 is 1 by 2. So, now cos of a plus b, cos a cos b minus sin a sin b equals to 1 by 2. So, the sin a sin b directly we can substitute, but we have the cos a and cos b. So, that is why the cos a and cos b should be expressed in terms of sin functions. So, this cos a we can write root of 1 minus sin square a. This is root of 1 minus sin square b minus sin a sin b equals to 1 by 2. Now, can we replace sin a and sin b values by x and 2x respectively? Yes, why not? So, let us replace it. This will be root of 1 minus x square. This is root of 1 minus 4x square. How? 2x whole square is 4x square minus x into 2x equals to 1 by 2. Now, you do one thing now. So, this can be simplified like this. Root of 1 minus x square into 1 minus 4 x square minus 2 x square equal to 1 by 2. Multiply both sides with a 2. You get like this. 2 root of 1 minus x square, 1 minus 4 x square and minus 4 x square equals to 1. Take minus 4 x square that side. That means actually that is transposing. So, if you would you like to transpose minus 4 x square that side that becomes positive. So, we get 1 plus 4 x square that is obvious. So, 2 root of 1 minus x square multiplied by 1 minus 4 x square equals to 1 plus 4 x square. Again squaring on both sides, squaring on both sides, squaring on both sides. So, let us see what do we get it. On squaring on both sides, we get this becomes 4 times 1 minus x square into 1 minus 4 x square equals to 1 plus 4 x square whole square. Let it be simplified. This is the product of the here two polynomial, polynomial that means binomials only. So, we get 4 times 1 minus 4 x square and minus x square plus 4 x to the power of 4 equals to. So, now left uh, right hand side is a plus b whole square form 1 plus 8 x square I am writing directly plus 16 x to the power of 4. So, let it be simplified 4 minus 16 x square. So, sorry this will be 5 x square directly we can write 20 x square plus 16 x to the power of 4 just carefully observe this is minus 5 x square multiplied by 4 that is minus 20 x square. So, 1 plus 8 x square plus 16 x to the power of 4 16 x to the power of 4 16 x to the power of 4 will be get cancelled. So, we have here transpose minus 20 x square that side 1 this side that means you get like this 20 x square plus 8 x square equal to 4 minus 1. This is 28 x square equal to 3. x square is equal to 3 by 28. Now, what will be the x value? 
सो ईयर एक्स इज इक्वल टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ थ्री बाई ट्वेंटी एट प्लस आर माइनस सो दिस कैन बी रिटेन प्लस आर माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ थ्री बाई फोर इंटू सेवन दैट इज प्लस आर माइनस रूट थ्री बाई टू रूट सेवन सो आई ऑलरेडी टोल यू सो वेन एवर यू गेट वेन यू सॉल्व एनी इक्वेशन द वेरिफिकेशन हैज टू बी डन सो दैट मीन्स द वेरिफिकेशन वी हैव टू वेरीफाई वेदर सोल्यूशन सैटिस्फाई द गिवेन इक्वेशन आर नॉट सो बिकॉज सिंस इट इज अ पॉजिटिव वैल्यू द ओनली द पॉजिटिव सोल्यूशन विल सैटिस्फाई दिस इक्वेशन दैट्स वेरी कॉमन थिंग सो दैट मीन्स वी हैव टू डिस्कार्ड नेगेटिव सोल्यूशन सो दैट मीन्स दैट इज द एक्सट्रॉनियस सोल्यूशन हैज टू बी डिलेटेड इन दिस केस सो नाउ द सोल्यूशन इज एक्स इज इक्वल टू रूट थ्री बाई टू रूट सेवन एंड वन मोर दिस द सोल्यूशन माइनस रूट थ्री बाई टू रूट सेवन दिस इज नॉट द सोल्यूशन दे हेंस एक्स इक्वल्स टू रूट थ्री बाई टू रूट सेवन दिस इज द सोल्यूशन 